Hello everyone, welcome back. This episode here, um, I'm gonna try to salvage uh, parts from these uh, doors I also found. Um, I like getting these um, because you could find another door, cut through, and reuse this. Um, so that's what I'm doing here. All they do here is they start caulking. Usually these things have plugs. But well, sometimes when people install them, they, they lose them, so they just screw them in, and then they just fill it with caulking. And so what I've done is, like some I've removed, others are a little bit harder. I have to really clean out the uh, all the caulking on it. So uh, that's what I've been having, just gouging it. And uh, my batteries died on my uh, impact driver. So, but before I get that done I've been using the micro grinder after I grind it out just trying to open this spot just a little bit more so my bit can have a little bite to it so I'm going around doing that just trying to clean it up um, of course using the micro grinder so the micro grinder is um, comes in really handy you know it sounds like a, a dentist drill um, so this is my first field test on this and so far it works really good it does grind it will grind the metal these are diamond tipped so it will grind the metal but that's all right um, I'm just trying to get these out as is right now now this is how some the screws look but as you can see you know you really got to get in there to clean them out and I've been blowing air so um, just give a little rest but uh, we'll see how it turns out um, let me see if I can uh, perhaps demonstrate one for you. So you just turn it. Let me see here. Which one is it? I'm gonna do. Uh, I'm gonna try. Let's try that one. That one's been done. Here, I just want to get to the middle so I push into it and then clean out the sides if possible. So let me see here. Oh, I gotta connect it. That would, might help. feet. There you go. So the air is going through. It's not super duper tight, but, you know, tight enough. to do this one-handed, so, excuse me, while I switch hands. that I'm just trying to get it to so it can my bit can bite onto the head of uh, uh, the Phillips uh, head here that's all I'm doing so I'll get that done and uh, we'll see how it, how it turns out all right I it's not fully charged but it's charged enough to make the impact driver work but uh, it's working really good as you can see so I've done a few by hand and realized it's, it comes it comes along pretty easy. I'll do it by by impact driver now. Let's see how it does. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's 
Look at that. That's wonderful. So let me finish up and uh, I'll uh, cut in at uh, another time now. All right. All right, I'm back. I took out all the screws here and let's see what it looks like. Uh, if you've never seen one of these before, I have a metal door. And this is a, excuse me, this is an insert. Call it an insert. So it's a little plastic piece on the back side because of the holes here. These are usually on the inside of the, the house residential doors. So we'll just put that aside. And then what you got here is uh, your insulated glass and the other plastic piece on the other side. And the other plastic piece usually is on the outside because you can't open these up because there's no screws on this side. But basically that's all an insert is, just uh, insulated glass, two plastic sides, painted over and cocked. Um, and that's that's all of it. So if I lift this door, I think the paint should just, uh, it's probably stuck with paint and caulking. So I have to probably flip it um, or something and uh, scrape it off. But that's it. So I got a couple more to go. And then... Um, as you see, it's just styrofoam, and then it's just a little steel, I don't know, 18 gauge or whatever gauge it is, pretty thin. So, anyways, uh, let me get this done and I'll try to wrap it up. Alright, I got, I got it off, I, I just had to push it a little bit, and so I, after I separated, I just pulled it out, and then... Um, cover on the other sides because I want, I want all this to go together so when I use it it's all there so um, so what I'm doing now is I'm putting it back in and if you noticed uh, I have my uh, drill instead of the uh, impact driver and the reason is because uh, I set this to a very low level so when it reaches a certain time it, it just doesn't turn anymore so I just don't want it too tight and uh, that prevents it from uh, being stripped because if I use it with my impact, uh, this thing will just keep turning and turning until the screw just goes right through the whole thing. So so once I get this done, that'll be, that should be it. I salvage a glass piece. I don't know what I'm going to do with the door. Um, most of it's styrofoam in the middle. We'll see if... Uh, um, a recycling metal recycler will take the steel and with the foam in the middle if I take everything off. Uh, they're kind of touchy about that, but we'll see what we can do. All right. So I guess that, that's the end of this episode. Um, well, let me let me finish and I'll and I'll come back. All right. Uh, so far, it worked out pretty good. This is what's left over. I'll try to salvage anything I can on this, but uh, let me see here. There's the uh, the insert right there, the door insert. Um, I could use it for something else, whatever I wanted to. So, anyways, uh, that should conclude this episode. If you have any uh, comments, feel free to make them. Uh, like, dislike. Also, you can do a video response. Uh, until then, uh, stay tuned for the next episode. Bye.